Hey guys, it's Band Designed here, and I have my 3D text template uh, pack coming out. I've got six different text templates. They're pretty simple, but I think they're pretty effective. So this is just the first one, which is the solid color curve template. Basically, because there's more than one layer, uh, we've just got in here. There's multiple text layers. All you have to do to edit it is basically click on all of these so just click on the bottom or the top and hold shift and click the rest and then down the bottom here it says text so we can just type in anything you want so I type in tutorial and there we go we've got tutorial in there um, also if you um, have this camera down here make sure when you're rotating um, unless you want to actually save a different picture view um, make sure that uh, you unclick it so it's not the white colored if you just want to have a look around but um, yeah make sure you if you want to have it in the main view then just click on that one over there now if you want to save it what you have to do is go up to the render settings up here and go to save and because there's no save file basically you just click the dots and then choose where you want to save it and then once you've done that just press the render button in the middle next to it which uh, I'm not going to render again okay so that's how you do that one uh, I'm just going to show you the rest of them just give you a quick uh, quick outlook of what there is. Okay, so we have this one which is an angle one, it's got two pieces of text. Top text is there, bottom text is there, same thing with the camera. Um, when we want to save it, because I've already got a save destination, what you do is you just change that and then you press the render button and it'll go automatically there. Okay, and the next one is this one, it's a purple, it's uh, just got one text. Same with the camera, it's a nice purple one. It looks has a bit of a shine on it. And then there's oh we've got I already show this one. And that one. And here's another one which is a colourful one. It's got a metal metalish reflective background and you can change this green colour to whatever you want. Same with the other ones. All you have to do there is just go down to the texture. Um oh, wherever it is down here. And where it is there and then we'll just find it uh, here we go, lime green double click on that and you get this colour up here basically if we want to change that to let's say a red we could do that, make it red and there we go, it's a red that's basically how I do it and then just rendering like normal uh, and then we'll go on to the next one and then there's this one which is sort of a metal um, corrugated effect and uh, select all the text to edit it and you're good to go. You can also change the colour of any of the textures. And then we have this one which is the final one and it's basically a thin metal one similar to the other one. Um, it's got two different effects. There's a lot of lights in here so if you'd like to remove some then that gives a different uh, image on the tutorial. Okay, so we'll close that one. So Basically, I'm just going to show you what the text looks like rendered. This is the first one. Last one I just showed you. Nice metal reflective. Then we have the straight metal corrugated effect on the side. Then there's the green one, which you can change the colors. Like I showed you with red, and it's metal reflective. Then the straight purple one, which looks really nice under some night lights. <laughs> the black angled one, you can change this color if you don't like the black. And then the curved one, and yeah. Um, and then that's basically it. So hope you enjoyed these tutorials um, and the pack guys. Just I'll leave a download link in the description. And yeah, thanks for coming. And I'll be bringing out more packs in the future. See you guys.